Jesus. Lord God Almighty, remember Jehovah. Oh God Almighty, you know everything. Lord God, give peace with the understanding. Mighty God, who the doors that the enemy are trying to shut for him. Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you are it to be praised this morning. Lord God Almighty, you are worthy this morning. Lord Jesus, you died for us on the cross, Lord. Mighty God of Daniel, you are rest to the perishing. Care for the dying, Lord. Mighty God of Daniel, cover us, mighty God. From where I point to the great God, Jesus, your blood, Jesus, is all that really matters, Lord. And mighty God, touching you, Jesus. Lord God, our life shall never be the same, Jesus. Lord God Almighty, oh Jesus, remember the testimonies. Remember the acts of exaltation, Lord. Lord God Almighty, because of you, because of who you are this morning, we give you praise, Lord. Oh God Almighty, remember the offering and the tithe. Touch it, Lord. Oh God Almighty, turn the mercy for who is coming. Yes, them foot. Lord, mighty God of Daniel has taught us to say, Our oh, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those that trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Glory! Amen. Hallelujah! Amen. Jesus. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Glory! Well, thank the Lord for leading our sister in such a mighty way. Santina to be at the place, my sister. Our morning list is taken from St. Mark 14, reading from verse 32 to 42. Mark 14 from the 32 verse and at the 42. Mark 14. And they came to a place which was named Gethsemane, and he said to his disciple, Sit ye here while I shall pray. And he take with him Peter, James, and John, and they gone to be sore amazed, and be very heavy, and said unto them, My soul is exceedingly sorrowful unto death. Tarry ye here and watch. And he went forward a little, and fell on the ground, and prayed that, if it were possible, the hour might pass from him. And he said, Abba, Father, all things are possible unto thee. Take away this cup from me. Nevertheless, not what I will, but what thou wilt. And he comes and find them asleep in, and said unto Peter, Simon, sleepest thou, couldest not thou watch one hour? Watch ye and pray, lest ye enter into temptation. The spirit truly is ready, but the flesh is weak. And again he went away and prayed and sweet the same words. And when he returned, he found them asleep again, for their eyes were heavy, neither with thee was an answer him. And he come, come at the third time and said unto them, Sleep on now and take your rest. It is enough. The hour is come. Behold, the Son of Man betrayed unto the hands of sinners. For the soul ended. Rise up, let us go. Lo, he that betrayed me is at hand. This is a portion of that word we read in the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be, where without end. Amen. Amen. Let's pray to the Lord, church. Hallelujah. 
say I have the pie the church. Magnify the Lord, Regina. You know this more we should rejoice in. Because we know that our Savior is no longer on the cross. Amen, church. Amen. Our next song is 33 from the same melody that praise the whole rugged cross. And I hear for a way to the old rugged cross. The emblem of suffering and shame. And I love that old cross with the dearest and best for a world of lost in our sin.
sometimes, if you never do it for me and it never do it for you, but this morning I'm here to tell you, it was bitter, it was just ties. All of the sin was up in him. Hallelujah, this morning. Glory. Let's worship the Lord, preaching. Let's magnify the Lord. Jesus, you're worthy, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Lord. This morning, I feel the cold bread here. I have the chance. It's in an ill far away. So that all wrong and cross. The emblem of suffering and shame. And, and I love that old cross where the dearest and best for a world of lost sinner was slain. You know, Pajin, it was that it coming for that purpose. It may look hard for me and you. Cause you know sometimes when man just get up and tell her we all man up here, you know, do it. And we know so our pro our Jesus was crucified for not being. This morning, he said, Oh, that old Holy Cross, do despise by the world as a attraction, a abundant attraction for me. For the dear love of God left his glory above to bear it to God. Calvary, you know, this morning, what a real look on Bridget. He tell me this morning, Oh, God, say the whole world despise it. And Hi, the world, but this morning I'm telling you, it was an attraction for me and you, Bridget. For the dear Lamb, leave that wonderful splendor, leave heaven and come on and earth for me and you, Bridget. He never have to do it, Bridget. He could have taught that chosen angel. I remember his scripture, he said, if it is possible to his father, let this cup pass. But he says, not his will, it's the father's will. I'm up to do as he said, Bridget. He can't go up on the world. That's the way you go up on the world. He says, he's coming down for a fall and a falling race. So I have to do it. I have to fulfill his promise, Bridget. So he couldn't do nothing but have to go through it. He said, in the whole world and crawl, say with blood so divine, a wondrous beauty I see. But twice on that old crawl, Jesus suffered and died to pardon and sanctify me. So Jesus did what is just like this. He pardoned me and he sanctified this morning, Virgin. He said, to the whole rugged cross, I will never, to the old rugged cross, I will never be true. To the old rugged cross, I'm sorry, to the old I will ever be true. It's shame and reproach gladly be. You know, sometimes there is mistake because we're not ever true. You know, sometimes we're not true. We say yes, we will go to the end. We will be, be in church. We will be obedient. We will listen to the word. We will not make a letter shape and a letter. I am a word shape. But this morning, it, we are making that mistake. Never, but this one is the ever, but this one I hope to God we will always be true. It's shame and reproach, glad to be that He will call me someday to my own far away where His glory forever will share. That's what we're working for, friends. We're gonna walk what hell, hell real, the fire real, the world real, and we don't want to hell, but we can't just get up and Talk to the motor. We don't want what they saw. We don't want what they saw. But we are the far from God. Bridget, we have to do the thing what is pleasing unto God. He said, Come in for a spotless church, Bridget. Oh God, he not easy. But remember those words. He said, Must not discourage. He said, Must keep courage. He said, Let no man deceive us. Brethren, to remember the word of God because in our life. So I will cherish the whole rugged cross, Brethren. I will cherish the whole rugged cross till my trophy at last lay down. I will cling, I will cling 
to that cross, Rachel. Oh God, what is a cross? A charity literally cross, but we can know about. But our cross is when they get up and just I swear and do we harm man up there. But this morning, now let nothing move us. Make me know that the devil is a life from your God. And at times, it's not we doing it, it's the devil speaking in us. That's as he's speaking to Peter when the Lord of the rebuke Satan. I was a Peter speaking in going to Judas. Sometimes at the heart, oh God, the heart of the armor, he gets privilege to enter. But this morning, our heart, let our heart be pure and clean. Breaching uh, the devil will enter sometime, uh, but we pray too much. Uh, the devil will enter sometime, uh, but we call on the name of Jesus too much. Uh, the devil will enter sometime, uh, because we say the blood. Blood of Jesus. Uh, so the devil time, uh, when the heart was we to approach, uh, he will say the blood. Uh, This young man will talk about the blood of Jesus here, man. Not because someone is going to try it. And sometimes the devil gets through. Continue to call in the name of Jesus. I tell you, it's power. Power in the name of Jesus. He can't say what can wash away my sins. He said nothing about the blood. He said power in the blood. Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah, remember my days and oh God, when I used to live by Malvern and this guy just get up and takes it from me without a car to break in. My God, I went and called upon Jesus and I talked to Jesus that he can't bear it no more. I mean, I don't know what we do, why the devil takes it from me so he can't bear it no more. And I call in the name of Jesus and I remember the last time when he called, ready like he wanted to come and grab me. But preaching, I lose. Because Brady just said, I see you coming down like you are the devil and come snatch me. Bring me first and snatch the devil. But then preaching, I go to my bed. He tell me, say, I lose my tense. Can he say, the battle are not for me. He said, vengeance belongs to him. And I don't know what the Lord they have a plan. But I made the move too fast. Wait up on the Lord. Wait. Going to preaching, the Lord cannot talk to you. The Lord cannot fight for us. The Lord cannot give up a standard. For us, preaching is in the strength to continue because I know my God don't lie. My God can't lie. My God, my God, I can't trust in you, preaching. Can't lie, preaching. Same word not avoid. And let's accomplish that is in God's Let's praise the Lord, Regina. Yeah. 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 He's risen from the grave. If you know that he's no longer on the cross, call on the name of Jesus. He's no longer on the cross. He's no longer. We know we serve a risen. Who is in the world today? We don't care. We don't matter. We don't care what man wants to say. Who wakes us up this morning? Who let the daylight? Who let the night? Who let the sun? Who let the moon? Who let the stars in the sky? Can mankind be that? Mankind cannot be that. So the self who said, we know who we are, who we are serve. An idiot of our church, an hypocrite of our church. But is it still, you know what time I swear it's going to be in the end. So, Regina, no matter what a man want to say, you're not going to cut yourself and prove them. My dissent to me said, when some say, oh, my dear, Christian, you believe in one who say Christian wear, but me not prove to me. I want to make it glory, preaching. And you know, preaching, when the end 
said me are just starting to get stronger because them say want to take me again say help me go and I push you push me come me I say Lord Jesus me I go pull them wrong somebody might criticize you and I tell them and be on and up there sure them say prove them wrong not quite yourself not worry with nobody leave all the chance to God but if, if you are served God and you don't go through nothing yet, you don't go through nothing. You don't go through You don't go through No child of God will not go through nothing yet. You don't go No child of God will not go through nothing. Because we have so much testimony since I accept Christ. But me and I see nobody in a rock with me. I tell her that question. Sometimes a daughter, oh God, you know when you were saying to me, say, me, you share my, my son, which is her brother. I know things they hear about me, but they couldn't tell it to me because they know the type of mother. But pray in this morning, you can't tell me anything. Come, Benjamin, don't belong to me. He said, the fact is that mine, so no matter what you do unto me, yes, it hurts. What's your prayer? Call the name there, them, preaching. No matter the time for we cook war with nobody. And they still a child of God. We are war. And they hear when they continue. Say them, say, and you say, you must fight if you must choose. God never die. And God never choose, preaching. And if God is we talking about, Jesus Christ is no love at that cross. He's at the right hand of his father. Oh God, bridge in. Oh God, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God, for your word. And only son can be not to my give away my son for the world. And I see a world. Oh God, despise him. Bridge in. Make this time for Jesus. Don't give up now. Oh God, remember it's not your love on the cross. Remember his wit. Be his wit you and to the end. Oh God, I don't want to say I said, hard oh, man of pain, breaking God and leave them because he loved the people there. He loved it. the only person I love is the devil himself. And all of us are man or God. Image preaching. So this morning, brother, just asking you stay connected to this man Jesus. You know the same is you know when they are saved in God. And you know we're looking sometimes in the church in that time, ready to say what we want to see the power of the church again and preaching that like some of my speak to me and say that remember how much you used to walk with me. It was 72 was walking with me and it comes down to 12. So don't let the heart be troubled. Bridget, may I tell you, so I tell God for the word. Timothy, no lie. Man can be lovers of themselves. The church can be empty. So they have to find one, two, and three. So pray to remember the word. Remember the word, Bridget. Hallelujah. So this morning, I just ask you to pray my strength. Pray my strength in the independent of your prayer. Until I continue, I will continue this way. Until the Lord take me home. And I'm not going to be my reason here. Oh, God. Thank you, worship the Lord. It's a privilege to be God's out on another day to lift up his matchless name, to worship and to adore him. Indeed, our God is a good God. Are you feeling blessed this morning? Yeah. Hallelujah. We want to thank the Lord for being here to share that we have to do our morning's devotion. Indeed, we have the privilege and the access that many people do not have this morning. Because we are unable to get up and walk to church or drive to church and we are in church worshiping our God, our Creator, our Maker. And not our countries, they don't have this opportunity. 
for this morning we are well privileged and we are blessed. Amen, church? Amen. Amen. Just be welcome to be in the presence of God this morning. Feel that you are special, knowing that he created you special, and special you are this morning in God's house. Um, we don't have any notices at the moment, but we just want to continue to pray as we go. Our prayer breakfast is coming up in June, so we have to put that in mind. People of God continue to pray and trust in God that everything will work out fine for us. I'm going to ask you to stand with me. I'm going to invite our praise team to come. Yeah. 
Shall we worship the Lord? Shall we bless the Lord? Shall we bless the Lord? Hallelujah, hallelujah. If that is a love, I don't know what love is. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your love, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.
Chame a preço do Lord. Chame a preço do Lord. Sure, I'm not dead for 
them either. Worse if they make problems. But Jesus took on my sin, my dirty, nasty ways, and he gave his life for me. We're going to go into some testimonies. We're going to have Brother Jevon. Then we're going to have Sister Sanaika. We may come Brother Jevon and Sister Sanaika. Praise the Lord, church. Praise the Lord. First, let me give greetings to the Holy Spirit of God, to the Bishop who's under us, and to his lovely wife, and to you, you know, the astrologer congregation. Um, you know, I've had so much on me. You know, I can recall um, one Friday night, we were at New Fellowship, and it's been a while, like, I should have given this testimony, but I put it to just come, oh, that. So, yes, we were at New Fellowship one night, and um, we ended. And we we're going home, and we we're outside talking for a, a bit before we left. And uh, when it was time, when we to find, when we were to go, right? Uh, I went home, and everybody went home, and reached out. Um, we can't be hungry at the time, so we we'll share some food with me and think. I want to eat and so forth. And we took a couple of and empty a bag. We realized that the food never come out of that. Anyways, and I said, where could we could for me? And uh, that night it was Sister Alinka who dropped us down. Right? So I was wondering if the phone left in her car as well. And when I called her, I was not getting to her. And uh, when I eventually got to her, she said, um, where could the phone be? And she checked her car and the phone is not at the, in the car. Anyways, uh, but during that whole happening, I was not nervous or panicking. Right? It's just we just we just had the peace. We just did say, we just did the confirmation that everything would be okay. You understand? And um, I couldn't even finish eating my food. So um, I called Sanayaka and I said, I can't find the phone. So uh, then the lady said to me, and um, when it happened that we call up here, we call Amina next door. Because she come inside, come check if the phone is over here or you know where it is. Anyway, she come and she must the phone. Now, me now, knowing that I cannot find the phone to jump on the laptop at the same time, I say, all right, find my device. And um, it happened that the phone has died to that 6%. And when I went on Google to find the device, um, it could not pick up the location, the exact location where it was because the location was turned off. Anyways, I said, what is this story? And I said, the phone has to work. And, um, but anyway, we jump on to the next one now for Samsung, and I said, all right, books and interview information. And um, lo and behold, here it was, right up here. Come on, what's up on the left? Right, but we're up here. Now, when um, me or Sammy, I come over here, and it's not over here, no. That's a weird piece thing. But I'm going to switch it to the left, right here, so. And um, anyways, we were out there to, you know, facilitate to come up here. But we came up here. Uh, but before that, I'm going to speak on something quickly. Google allows you to ring the phone even if it's on silent or vibrate for at least five minutes straight. And we all know how long it's five minutes when it reads, you know, and watch the time. And you know, when we came up here, I rang that phone. Well, before I came up here, I rang that phone at least five times. And you know, it rang extra loud because it's a situation where it's lost. And when I came up here, right, and we drove, we drove in, and the car stopped there, and the light shone on the wall right up there which part the tree is. That was where the phone light lay face down. Face down, Bridget. And when I came, I said, no, not God. Because anybody could have come to get, I'm coming and take it up. Because I ring loud, and I ring more than one time. Right? I will come in and say, look at God, you man. Look at God. You see this thing here, this thing serious what I do for the church. And we know God never done look at him just so. You understand? So anything that I plan, no man can stop that. You understand? So I encourage you guys this morning just to continue to support the church and what the church is doing. And if you can support any way, support. You understand? We need this thing well. And I just ask that to continue to give the guidance and the protection and the resources you know, to go where I want to go in him. These are my viewers. Um, 
when it comes down to um, the Easter, um, here, you know, I reflect a little bit more than usual, knowing that, you know, he left all the niceness in heaven to come here to take my, my, my place, right? The songwriter said, knowing his destiny, he left the splendor of heaven and he came here to die on dark Calvary for me. I am just extremely grateful to be here another Easter to think of the goodness of God, um, to be among the saints and to, you know, just reflect on, I will not die for Ariel, I will not die for Erika, I will not die for Lamar, neither my mom, but Jesus came and he did it all. You know, as a writer said, just for me, Jesus came and he did it for me. He died that lonely death just for me. By your spirit I will arise from the ashes of defeat. Your resurrected King is resurrecting me. By your name I come alive to declare your victory. The resurrected King is resurrecting me. By your name I come alive to declare your victory. Cause my resurrected King is resurrecting me. You continue to pay my strength while I continue to the Lord. Hallelujah! Let me hear the worship of the Lord. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Indeed, God is a good God. I thank the Lord for these two testimonies. These people of God, let us continue to pray. Pray up each other, especially for our young people. As we hear Brother Javon speak of the four God has done some things at times. You wonder, my God, I really God. You know, God is good. We ask that they pray up the young people. Pray them up, people of God. Pray their strength, and as yesterday we asked for prayer for the missionary, we thought I think one of our the young one, the sure is faith, one of them not feeling well, um, or oh, yeah, he is down with the flu, and uh, quite a lot of people are complaining that they are having some flu symptoms, we ask that you pray up the young people, pray their strength, and as Brother John said, eat, and I am not well, you well, they know the flu from one thing, I can pray for that food. Come on, Jesus, I'm not going to let them move, not in my word, and let them stay with the, the symptoms, you know. We have to pray, people of God. And as Brother Javon says, he, he, he takes the word of God very serious. People of God, anything I tell you, have the opportunity to do for God. Do it with your willing heart, with all of your heart. Give a hundred plus, a hundred percent. No matter what I eat and drop, I just do it for God like at the last opportunity. Because I'm telling you, your testimony will be great. When you give to Jesus, you don't have the money enough. People have got your time, your resources. There is a team, personal, food, and everything. And anytime your call is always ready. Let me tell you something that people that must have some testimony. God, God always do some things for them that they must know that is because of what you are doing, why you are so covered, why you are so protected. Let me not take it for granted, people of God. I'm going to ask you to stand, I'm going to ask you to Jennifer to come for the panic in the day. Offering, the tithes, we're going to sing from the melody, so the redemption. Redemption number 69, anybody have redemption? Rev up one. Think it arise, my soul arise. So I'm gonna ask the Jennifer to come first and she's gonna bless the offering before we start.
Thank you, Prof. God. Good morning. Okay, I'm reading Galatians chapter 6, verses 7 to 9. And it reads us, Be not deceived, God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. For he that soweth to his flesh, shall of the flesh reap corruption. But he that soweth to the spirit, shall of the spirit reap life everlasting. And let us not be weary in well-doing, for in due season we shall reap if we pay not. The word of the Lord. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for today. Thank you, God, that we can come into your presence once more to give back, oh God, of what you have blessed us with, whether in tithes, offering, whether, oh God, in our praises, mighty God, I ask you, oh God, to bless us. Father God, as your people come with your cups of turn, I wait to know, God, you are blessing, mighty God. I pray, God, that you will let our cups overflow, mighty God. With of the living God, I pray, oh God, you fall sweet fresh upon this offering and tithes. Let it be used for the furtherance of your kingdom. But I tell you thanks. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.
and were esteemed in not. We are new from all of it, bless the name of Jesus. Surely we had borne our grief and carried our sorrows, yet we did esteem him stricken, smitten of God and afflicted, bless the name of Jesus. But he was wounded for our transgression, and he was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him with his stripes we are healed. And so we could go on and on, bless the name of Jesus. I want to come back to the uh, to Mark chapter 14, as we have read from verse 32 to 42. Bless the name of Jesus. And that brings me to pull our team. Hallelujah. The agony of the cup. Bless the name of Jesus. And so in Matthew 20. At one point in time, Jesus speak of a cup. Hallelujah. When Salome, Hallelujah, his mother's sister, brought to a James and John, and they seized the opportunity, wants to seize the opportunity that one would sit on the right and one would sit on the left. Jesus made it known to them that it is not given to him to decide who will take this position. But that if they could if they could endure the cup and they were speaking about a cup that would come bless the name of jesus and so Lord, one when we read when we read saint mark chapter 14 hallelujah and we observe the word of god bless the name of jesus we can highlight Several different events that took place, but one of them that stood out in such a time was the, the agony that was upon our Savior. Bless the name of Jesus. And so Jesus Christ, according to according to scriptures, Hallelujah, came to the place that was called Gethsemane. You used to have this garden, hallelujah, outside of town. It was a weekend that was very much busy in Jerusalem because it was the Passover. And so Jesus would resort to a place where they often go to pray, hallelujah. It was a garden, the garden gets settled in, hallelujah, which interpret a place of press, which they produce olive. And so they would press the olive to get the oil from it. And so, therefore, Lord, I will say to you that Gethsemane is a place of press. Hallelujah. Not speaking about the olive anymore, but the place, hallelujah, of agony. And so I will commend you to leave that place that God gets in me. Hallelujah. It's a place of precrastination. If you got something to do in life, hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. Whether it's in church or family, or in your workplace, get it over with. Things that you can do today, never put it off until tomorrow. You have some people, at times, the time they have something to do, they keep pushing it off and pushing it off until it's never done. I am here in the church of God. And so I will say to you, bless the name of Jesus, leave that place God can send me. Hallelujah. To, to Jesus Christ, carry the for a while. It, it is not a good place. And so, Lord, man, I can tell you this, bless the name of the Lord, as we reflect on what, what transpired at that time, Jesus Christ already knew from he came into the world that his sole purpose was to die for the whole human race. Bless the name of Jesus. He was prophesied by the prophet Isaiah, hallelujah, and he himself Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. Who predict his own death. Bless the name of the Lord. But I can tell you that nothing could have done before the time. When you read the Gospel of John. John chapter 18. I wish somebody, I wish that you would put it up on the screen. Hallelujah. John chapter 18 from verse 1. Going about to verse 9 somewhere here. You will find a verse. Hallelujah. That speaks expressively that when they came 
at the garden of Gethsemane, after the agony, or during the agony, bless the name of the Lord. And Jesus Christ presents himself in the Baha'i, bless the name of the Lord. Two or two us came out to kiss him and identify. Hallelujah. Move some verses there. I want the verse that speak that when, when they ask, Jesus Christ asks the question, who do you see? And then in the clear, hallelujah, then said in the clear that it was Jesus. And he declared that I am he. When Jesus Christ said, I am he, hallelujah, and then decided to move forward, hallelujah, they were all thrown to the ground. Somebody can identify that verse, bless the name of Jesus. I want to follow me in the Bible, ready. Follow me in the Bible. Verse 4, hallelujah. Jesus therefore knowing all things that should come upon him, went forth and said unto them, Whom seek me? Read on, my brother, read on, move on. Hallelujah. They answered him, Jesus of Nazareth, said unto them, I am he, and Judas also, which betrayed him, stood with them. Read on, read on. Hallelujah. As soon then as he had said unto them, I am he, they went backward and fell to the ground. Want you to understand that it was seven thousand men come out. Hallelujah, just carry one man. Hallelujah. And when man identified himself, that does, that does do that kiss. But he said, I am he. Hallelujah. The whole seven, the whole seven hundred are seven thousand fathers up and empty. Lift your and praise God. That is the power. Hallelujah. It never happened. It never to do anything. It never was escaping. But I can tell you this: the weight and the pressure was upon him. And so when we go to Luke chapter twenty-two, is another parallel account of what took place and transpired. Now we have to by the video. Bless the name of Jesus. Luke twenty-two fifty-three. Tell you that there was a special hour and a special time. Hallelujah. Time and place matter. Bless the name of Jesus. And so when Luke gives me account, bless the name of the Lord, I call to Luke 22, 53. When I was daily with you in the temple, he stretched forth, he, he stretched forth no hand against me. But this is your power and the power of darkness. Say this, Jesus Christ was teaching, preaching, healing, Doing wonderful works, miraculous work, hallelujah, and then never stretch forth one hand to hurt him. But now the time come, hallelujah, when the enemy should advance. Bless the name of Jesus. I can tell you, bless the name of the Lord, it was the Satan intention that Christ should go to the cross. Bless the name of the Lord. He knew exactly, hallelujah, that that was very crucial. If Jesus Christ goes to the cross, then something extra hard would have, would have happened. And that was his sole responsibility that Christ should go to the cross. Matthew chapter 4, when it came with the temptation, the temptation was to elude him from go to the cross. Bless the name of Jesus. I call to Matthew 16 and to verse Peter. Hallelujah. I love himself. He will do it. Even though he can't test the Christ, that this is the Christ, hallelujah, and the key was given to him, hallelujah, bless the name of Jesus to the kingdom. He allowed himself to be manipulated by Satan and begin to rebuke Jesus. When Jesus began to pre predict his death and to listen to him, the Son of Man shall be betrayed and handed over into the hands of sinful men and then when they nearly pulled the cross and took the fight. Hallelujah. Peter declared to this good one, stop that nonsense. This cannot be. This is an outrage. You cannot go to the cross because you are the Christ without understanding. This is Jesus Christ for your name. Hallelujah. And the disciples were still in ignorance and in darkness. Just like now. Just like you know, this time that we are living in. You have people who are going to church. Bless the name of Jesus, and still never get the understanding and the knowledge of what is the assignment of Jesus Christ, what is the whole purpose. And so, as we look at the chapter of what, bless the name of the Lord, we only can we only can deal with a 
certain area where we try to cover as much as we can. Bless the name of the Lord. And so as he was in the garden of Gethsemane, hallelujah, at the place of press, the hour I called to you was now upon him. The hour was at hand. And so this hour was the time when, when darkness should appear, hallelujah, over him. Bless the name of Jesus. Not because darkness appeared to him or over him, that means to say darkness did triumph over him. It was the given time when the pain and the pressure, hallelujah, when the weight, hallelujah, and the sorrow was upon him. Bless the name of Jesus. And so Mark, Mark recorded that he was exceedingly heavy. Hallelujah. He was what? Exceedingly heavy. Bless the name of Jesus. And he, and he has taken with him Peter, James, and John. This is the inner circle. Hallelujah. To be sore, amazed, and to be very heavy. And said unto them, My soul is exceedingly sorrowful unto death. Carry ye here and what? No, this is this is the Christ that I go. The weight and the pressure. No, let me tell you something, man. Sometimes we are going through some things in our life, man. And we are saying, why? I tell you, you don't know how we feel. But Jesus knows how you feel. There is no sorrow. There is no weight. There is no pressure or sadness that you can imagine that Christ will know about and experience. All this sorrow and pain and pressure was upon, was upon Christ. Sometimes we feel a little pain and we feel like some boy will lose the life. He tells that he small was exceedingly heavy to the place that he come like to kill him. Talk to me, Jesus. Sometimes you feel some pain and you feel like you are dead. Hallelujah. You feel like say, a death will have come. Hallelujah. And so Jesus Christ was at that place when the weight of our sin, when the pressure of our sin was upon him, blessing him of Jesus, he was pressed and crushed. Hallelujah. Now the Father was about to turn up his indignation. Hallelujah. Upon him, the wrath of God against sin was about to turn out upon his holy son. And so all of us, Jesus Christ was at that place, blessed name of Jesus, where he was acquainted with grief. A man of sorrow. Hallelujah. Blessed name of Jesus. And his soul was exceedingly heavy. So we are going to do some little slight things. Hallelujah, and we will, we are going. Talk to me, Jesus. And so all of us, he was in that place where the enemy now believed that he could have taken advantage. And so his flesh began to cry out because he was exceedingly heavy and sad. The Bible never tell us that he had laughed about it. Bless the name of Jesus. And he never happy about that at all. So he had time and sins when he was through some real rough stuff. Bless the name of Jesus. Sadness. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Luminous. Distress. Pressure. Hallelujah. And so Jesus Christ. Bless the name of the Lord. To Peter, James, and John that was designated. He placed them at a strategic point and said, Watch with me. Help me near this. And so the ones, hallelujah. We will have close people, close friends. Hallelujah. We are about associate now. We are not all those people where you fellowship with that are all them are your close friends. And so you can find that them. They will be your prayer partner. They will be the one that will go, hallelujah, and help you in a certain situation. Where you financially, emotionally, bless the name of Jesus, or spiritually. Those are the ones that you can depend upon. And so Peter, James, and John was his inner circle. You know, we took them for certain mission so they were designated. Bless the name of the Lord. The rest of the disciples, they never seen the anguish when I go through. They never seen the tears. They couldn't see it. Hallelujah. They were distant. And so therefore, you can have some people still love you, but they're distant. Hallelujah. They will love you from a distance. They can, they can talk with you. They can help you. But they are distant. You would invite them in a certain situation. You would tell them certain problem. Bless the name of Jesus. You will ask them to pass through your prayer when you do certain situations. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. And so these were close, close disciples where you can find in a way to church. 
Hallelujah. And so he asked them, and you have to go with him, blessing him of Jesus, because his soul was exceedingly heavy. Hallelujah. I tore the trails that are allowed to be here. I'm glad I've come to the cross. And so therefore, Jesus Christ was feeling the agony. He was feeling the pain. Hallelujah. Sin become a weight. Sin become pain. Diseases. Bless the name of Jesus. Emotional feeling. Setback. Hallelujah. And so therefore, brethren, he was at that place where he was despised and rejected. Alienated. Bless the name of Lord. And so the disciples that he can find that and expect that probably they would help. Bless the name of Jesus. They couldn't help. They fall asleep. And so therefore, brethren, I tell you that you can't put your trust in a mankind. No matter how you're close to your unreliable. Bless the name of Jesus. Till a time come when man does can help you in a life. So stop when you have a Bless the name of Jesus. We don't really want to face that. Bless the name of the Lord. We don't want that all to come from it. But sometimes we may have to go through something. Hallelujah. That prayer now will change. Bless the name of the Lord. The Bible tells us that in prayer, till it sweat become drops of blood. Hallelujah. Sometimes, hallelujah, when God has to go through some situation, no matter how much profit, profit I have in life, no matter how much prayer you get, how much prayer you pass, you could have walked, hallelujah, from church to church. And you are not going to change the situation of the disciples. They still, that it should die. Hallelujah, it was God's divine plan that it should die and fear the Christ. No love one. The distant one that couldn't help him. The designated one that couldn't help him. No really divine help. And so he fleshed out the cry of the enemy beneath the red one. He could have taken advantage and said, It's too heavy for you here. You can't go through this. And no time to face some situation in a service, in a, in a service to God. And a minister that you could have thrown it to him. Bless the name of Jesus when people treat you, hallelujah, in a way that they disrespect you. When people, when people reject you, when people persecute you, hallelujah, I you go through some stuff. Bless the name of Jesus. You feel like you are throwing it to him. Bless the name of the Lord. But nevertheless, Jesus never threw any toil. And when you wait that you will murder upon him. And so Jesus Christ, bless the name of the Lord. Pray. And he flesh cry out. It's alright to feel the pressure. It's alright to cry. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But this is not going to change the route that God has to go to. And so, bless the name of the Lord. Here comes. Procrastination, which is a flesh, which is a self. Hallelujah. And in prayer, and said, Father, you know our things. But we wish and hope that this could have passed if you could have had it another way. Two of them you have an arrangement. I wonder if we could have worked out another way that this could pass away. Hallelujah. The agony of the cup was upon him. Something prayer now will change. Bless the name of Jesus because it's God's divine plan and will. And so we pray the prayer, bless the name of God, that we have to pray constantly, roll the clock, and we will in season of some season. Bless the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ lived up for the name and he's sitting there and he prayed the prayer. And he will say the same words three times. Hallelujah. And so he said, if it was possible, let me come past, but nevertheless, the love of our name. Nevertheless, not my will. Hallelujah. Knowing that the will of God is not to please him. He wasn't come to please himself, but to do the will of his father. In section 9, verse 4, he said, I must work the work of he that sent me. Why is he here? For the night coming when no one can work. We are in service to God. Hallelujah. And at times, precrastination will kick in. I want to do this. I want to help people do that. And the devil will say, put it off. Bless the name of Jesus and bless you say, too tired. You can't manage, put it off. Hallelujah. Why are you alone have to pick up this for your head? Why are you alone have to do this? I got bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The devil will show you all your loved ones and show you all your brethren and show you all your church and show you all your ministry and show you your reason to put it off. Reason to complain. Reason to forget. Bless the name of Jesus. But when you're devoted, not go 
It's like a pepper. Bless them up to you. The simple thing. Get them off. I die up in the tree. Talk to you. Bless the young lad. He was, he was like a sheep. Before you share him. No, I hope not in mouth. Sometimes you have to walk away from your mouth. In a betrayal. Then say you say. Me say. Hallelujah. Sometimes say you say. All right, me not say nothing. Who are the mouth? Are you here in the mercy? Who are you about to hold your peace? Hallelujah. The betrayer is at hand. The person that may deny you is at hand. The liar is at hand. Bless the name of Jesus. The man who ever said is at hand. Are you here in it? When a family friend or brethren, I go work, I don't really matter. Watch! That is the, that is, that is the remedy. Watch! I mean, I don't have to go lose my express. Eh? Can I make this way? But what be central, the end of the earth. How you hear me? So can't I pray when we can't hear pray? Don't come in. Bless the name of Jesus. I'm saying, God, forgive me. Do us like you do of mercy. Lord, if you sin that any way, hallelujah. I mean, I know. Bless the name of Jesus. I beg you. Black out the sin and the transgression. Hallelujah. Before you lay out sin, because you are the head of the world. Hallelujah. The man will repent of his sin. Bless the name of Jesus. I told men to go take him. Because he will repent. I told you, who will I tell you? Need to repent. The whole world. Constantly. Because what? Eh? We do it to Jesus. And if they do it to Jesus, they will do it to me and you. Talk to me, Jesus. No matter how talk about the children that I tell you. Because I'm the very dear. No matter how talk about who I am next of you. And if they say, you find people who are the best. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's a hard road to travel and a mighty long way to go. Who sees it knows it. Hallelujah, when you love me, this night, but who I have so, so nice spirit, you know it. We are going to have a testimony. But there is, if it's no cross, there is no crown. Hallelujah. Blessing him of Jesus. If it's no cross, there is no crown. You have been faithful to God. He will do the trial. Hallelujah. The God of God has been able to Hallelujah, in the court of man. Man, let me say something, man. Try to come to a court in the building. Are you here in the church of man? You have a whole heap of lawyer and barrister. We can't bring up a man to a panel. Hallelujah, find himself to a jury in a court. They can't get to a panel of the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Let me say something, man. People judge people, but we find church people more than anywhere else. Eh? Bless the name of Jesus. You cannot be close to nobody anymore. Eh? We're not going to do this. Nevertheless. Eh? No matter how you quiet. We're not no matter how you quiet. Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. No matter how you quiet in a church, somebody will find something to say against you. No matter how you minister, go and go. You will have to pull them glasses right now, see them, and call you to come down. Hallelujah. 
Aleluia, você viu aí que não tem banheiro. Ah, não há ah, você tá que não tem banheiro. Na desespero, não vai entrar. Quando eu louco, eu vou me errar. Ah, não há um canto que eu vou me errar. Ah, não há um canto que eu vou me errar. Ah, não há um canto que eu vou me errar. Ah, não há um canto que eu vou me errar. When you take that home, hallelujah, some temptation bless the name of Jesus, and we all go God himself to keep that at home. Hallelujah, my baby. Hallelujah. Listen and pray, God. Hallelujah. Some time right beside the temptation there. Right beside it. And so the fact, we have a close and even here. But nevertheless, nevertheless, Leave the enemy. Look to God to divine help. Hallelujah. He is the help of man. So we are look to God. He is the last and chosen day. Look to God. Whisper prayer. Bless the name of Jesus. Read that word. And let me tell you something ready. The word of God is never returned to his wife. But it will accomplish what God said. Enter the word of God and tell me where you can go for the other. You have to do it fast, and you have to do it The result to each of us is nothing. And so the rain comes down, and water in the earth, and the earth flourish. So we pray that the word of God will water the soul, and that the soul will prosper, and that it will prosper as God bless you. Please stand, church. Hallelujah. We love it. Bless the name of Jesus. And so, we went through. We went through. I felt this. I felt this. This worship song. Bless the name of Jesus. Do whatever you need. Do whatever you need. 
in spite of the odds, yes, Lord, in spite of what we are going to and facing in the, in the land of the love to make up so much, we still pray to nevertheless. We may serve you. You can't get no work. And so God we ask for your divine help in an every capacity. Not only in our ministry, in our day to day work with the Lord, but also in our country. We can leave it up to legislators. Hallelujah. We can leave it up to politics. We are looking to the Lord. Hallelujah. In a time like this, we will need you more than anything else. How are we steps, Lord, in your word? We pray, God, for more and find to the refine that we will cover up with your blood. Hallelujah, that we will not go on these to be held and become, Lord, according to your God. God, we are looking to you, Lord. And the nature that we get you, we will tear you in pieces. And we can wait until we are in the rubble. We are super mercy. Mighty God, we are right for those men because we become the wicked. Hallelujah. And so, therefore, mighty God, we pray that you will continue to transform the life of the people and to fill the church they will tell. How many find you the Lord? We come with our feet in their hands. We give the thanks in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And so the ones, hallelujah. Let us try to pray one for another. Live a life that will set you apart from the ordinary. Don't bow down to the scripture. Don't give in to do that. Don't let nobody tell you what they have in your back. Can you see a man that's about him on the back? We say, no. When a friend, family, and a veteran, hallelujah, it doesn't really matter. Trust in the Lord. And let him direct, direct your path. God bless you. Continue to enjoy the season. And now may the same grace. Fellowship of the Holy Spirit, the Comforter, rest in men and by the Father, love keep us faithful and truth in God. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen.